Okay, folks. So it begins. My 79 Dodge Brome. Just got it in yesterday. Bought it over a year ago. Been sitting out in the field. Went out there, threw a battery in it, fired right up. Engine seems to be super tight. Brand new. Looks like a, somebody had put a reman in it because it's all clean and the rest of the chassis is dirty. A little bit of body work here. I don't know, they had something mounted here. Maybe an awning or bracket or something. A little filler. All this crap. You know, people, don't do this to your fucking RV. Idiots. You don't know how to do this shit. Hire somebody. All that's got to be dug out, thrown away. Got to put new freaking seals in on all the windows. Ugh, idiots. All right. Interior. So it begins. Today, today we're gonna jack it up, pull the right front has some issue with it, as you can see definite camber issue there. We either got a ball joint or a wheel bearing out. Uh, so we're going to pull the front apart, take a look at it. But these are hard to come by. And uh, you know, I hardly ever, I've only seen a couple of these in my life. So I bought it and bozos, you know, Put some freaking house air conditioner up on top because they couldn't figure out where to put a fucking generator in here. And it went through a hailstorm last year. It blew out all the, the vents up top. So, gonna prep it for paint. Gotta dig all that shit out. You see that? Fucking idiot. Dig all that crap out of there and put in real seal. Hopefully in uh, two weeks, we'll have this baby painted. And all this shit's gotta come out. We're gonna paint it Desert Storm Tan. Put some chromies on it. I'm gonna cut this panel. Inside here is uh, the stove and oven. Never gonna freaking use that shit. If I need an oven, I'll use my Dutch oven on a campfire. So, we're gonna open this panel up and get a panel hatch for it. Um, get a slide out and put a 3500 watt generator in here and uh, hook it to the fuel tank and maybe even make it dual fuel. Hook it on also to the uh, LP. Well, I'm going to get started on the front end. This is project number two. Still waiting on the state to send me my title for my other project. There's my Mini Winnie. That one is one sweet ride. That's going up for sale pretty soon, folks. I'm going to be asking about eight grand for it. It's only got 60,000 miles on it. Um, it's got an owning generator. I mean, it's nice. I redid the complete interior in that one. It is a sweet ride. This one, odometer says 41,000. 